hi everyone uh, in my previous movie I was showing you the if uh, statements uh, syntax and now we'll be moving a little much more advanced uh, syntax or a little more practical syntax of if so uh, what this script does basically uh, you can take any input out of X and Y from the user from the other sources maybe a form something else and you are comparing them now inside this you can add uh, as I told you this is a logical expression and in logical expression there are certain operators uh, you can use for uh, shake say this is equals com for comparison there is one thing that call not equals to means if not mm, it is not equal unequal numbers and there is another operator called greater than operator if x is greater than y and uh, there is also an less than operator uh, to provide if or x is less than y or you can both e use greater than or equal to sorry greater than or equal to means if x is greater than or maybe equal to uh, y and uh, less than equal to y is there is also another mm, logical expression now so remember the these basic operators one is equal to equal to for let's comment it out um, where is yes let's comment it out this part remember this logical expression for comparison this one is for uh, greater than equal to sorry I'm not writing it anymore I guess you can remember from the syntax or you can scroll the movie and one another thing that is say we I'm having three variables said and I want to put a condition something like say z is equal to 5 so I want to use two expressions uh, with the combination of them of of those two say if x is less than or equal to y which it is as you can see from the value they are 4 and 4 and um, say z is greater than x so remember this is an operator and uh, let's see how it shows up in the web browser uh, so as you have expected it can it will show the ok dialog box let's see and it did and you can use any combination of them on boolean expressions so basically this value is uh, 1 or 0 or this value is 1 and 0 and you can perform boolean arithmetic on them using this AND operator or you can use the OR operator so let's say this is 3 so still you will get the uh, alert function OK let's load it in the web browser again and you got it so mm, keep on trying with these functions and obviously you can put them in brackets uh, so if you don't know about much of this boolean expression don't worry about much but uh, uh, situation this this thing really requires and remember the operator names and the construction of the if so if it's not necessary that you will have one condition it might be two or three condition and how many you like in this case um, on later movies we will see some else statement and else if which another variation of if so see you in the next movie